Hello guys, good morning. Oh my god, my hair is still so new to me. I have to get used to it. So I've packed everything now. I think I haven't told you guys, but I will join a yoga retreat for the first time of my life. It will be six days and today is the arrival day. I will be staying there having two yoga classes every day. We have a lot of excursions, a very packed schedule, so I'm very excited to do that. And also all meals are included, so I'll be vegan for one whole week. That will be exciting. I'm in the car right now and it takes one hour to get there. There's a lot of spring water, so here we have wow. pool downstairs. Yeah. What is the mm -hmm. cool? Go to here to the yoga place. We still have a lot of time. The, the teacher will be as planned for that. Mm -hmm. You can okay. you can to ask the teacher also. Yes. Enjoy your lunch. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> Received in coconut. That's soup. Okay, it's my lunch. And then veggie soup, with broccoli, and oyster mushrooms. And then we have a vegan bowl with tofu, tempeh, some veggies, some spices, and milk coconut. Good. I think I will lose weight. Okay guys, actually I haven't shown you my room yet. So that is my room. I find it quite scary to have a sink in my room to be honest. Like it gives me kind of a jail vibe. But so far it looks kind of clean in here. So yeah, I got to know a few participants today and it's very peaceful. Everyone is in a very detoxifying mood. Of course, we are in a yoga retreat. Everyone's really lovely and loves the nature. To be honest, I feel like a bit misplaced because I'm such a city girl. I'm like doing YouTube and I'm so social and I need so much. I feel like that everyone here is like, they just need nature and themselves. So I really want to learn being so minimalistic, connect with the nature, that's why I'm here. Good morning guys. I had the worst sleep ever. I have my first yoga class in half an hour, so I'm gonna get up. I'm so tired. I don't have energy at all actually. <laughs> ready and now I'm gonna go to my first class which is right there I just ended my first class wow it was amazing it was one hour and 48 minutes long a really long class it was harder than i thought like we did headstands with the pro pose and everyone is so advanced i really love it i feel so energized now i'm so happy now i'm gonna have breakfast just had a little nap and now we'll have a offering making class yes. Good. Mm -hmm. okay
Yes. <laughs> I'm doing my second yoga class now. It's the afternoon yoga class and it should be more chilled. Good morning people. So we have day two. Why am I so energized? Because I had another very bad sleep yesterday night and also oh my god we get a full coconut here every day so that's why i've been drinking a lot like i just googled how many liters fit into a coconut and it's about one and a quarter liter so every day i'm drinking one and a quarter liters of coconut water so that's why i'm constantly need to go to the ladies room like yesterday i think i was like 20 times all the time but it's quite cleansing for the body so the schedule for today is we have a morning class now it's almost seven o'clock and then we'll do a Bali experience tour go to the village and do a cooking class and Balinese dance type of thing one more thing oh my gosh I haven't worked out for really the entire four weeks where I have been on this trip and after yesterday my muscles are so so sore it's only yoga but still feels like i did like a very hard workout that's the thing about having a break of working out but i feel totally toned after only one or two workouts yesterday so you boil it mm -hmm. so in traditional ways the woman will blow the oil and until we find like the really <laughs> So a lot of like Balinese traditional things. What we also did is we visited a primary school and that was the weirdest experience 
ever everyone was white except me yeah i'm asian but still we were like i don't know celebrities joining a huge class with like 50 up to 50 pupils they were greeting us and then we played a game where they could ask us questions to practice their English say like yeah where are you from or stuff like that and then the tour guide would give us some candy like chocolate or cakes and then we could give them the children we also had the opportunity to take some pictures with them but that was just so so crazy I don't think that Balinese pupils should be treated like wild animals or an attraction and giving their candy was like feeding animals but these were just my thoughts so yeah that was kind of weird It's so much tempeh here. Yeah. <laughs> it's same for it looks so cream like wow, creamy. Really? Like yes. yogurt. Is yeah. that from the candle nut? Yes. Yeah. Like a banana split. <laughs> <laughs> and sweet soy sauce. Like a chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> What's the name again of this? Gadu Gadu. Gadu Gadu. Can you take a picture? Mm. Okay guys, I'm just editing my vlog here. It's really really hard to work here. It really is a retreat. Like everyone is detoxifying from work I feel like. And all the people just hang around together, talk about their life and um, yeah I really love it but I still think about the work the whole time. Like, Actually, I'm just a beginner on YouTube, but I really take it serious and it's a lot of work. So I would be so happy if you could support me because I really put my tears, blood and sweat into this little baby. Today we had a cooking class and as you have seen from the footage here, then I will have a afternoon yoga like every day. And also we have a massage included in this program so I was thinking about getting it today because today I was really really exhausted and tired yes. day 4 today I had my massage yesterday night and now I feel like even Sora because she pressed everything the soul out of me oh. first one at class today it's 57 already so there are only three minutes left and guys i feel like it's a little bit of a survival camp here because with every single day the number of participants keep decreasing the best you can feel that's why at five you can Locking your body side to side. went away I leaned on to the railings good morning good morning I will have my last morning class now and I'm quite excited I must say it was a very tough week and actually I'm very proud of myself because there were only three kind of survivors Let me buy it. Is the 
this kind of thing. <laughs> or like killing animals. Making tea. Jamu Oh, it's my Okay, so this jamu looked like mm -hmm. that. So, yes, it's mm -hmm. very hot. So you need to yeah. wait. I like this is jungle to let him himself, but I think just because he's so. Yeah. That's like. That's why? What is this? morning guys i just quickly wanted to close off this vlog because a couple of friends would join me from berlin to my solo traveling journey solo because it's not solo anymore it was such a nice adventure i still gonna take you guys along with me a bit but not that much anymore since i want to enjoy my quality time with my friends thank you so much for watching in this series um it's been five weeks now and we will continue our journey in Bali first like we will travel around do some activities and then probably go back to Thailand because my return flight is from Bangkok so yeah thank you so much for watching love you guys I really encourage you guys to travel alone because it's so so worth it you will discover the world you will find yourself you will find new friends speak to new people go out of your comfort zone and yeah, I think it's just such a great experience and yeah, I really hope that I could inspire you to also travel alone and don't fear. Thanks again for watching and see you next time. Bye!